You have you belonging to revamp or wash your wig yourself, but you don't know the product, you don't know the essential product, or you don't know the things that you need to have at home to do this revamping to wash your wigs yourself because we know that the economy is not smiling and giving stylists every time and every now and then to revamp your wig you know it's not easy so at least sometimes you like to do it yourself then maybe from time to time to you like to take it to professional or you are also want to you also want to go into revamping you know as a profession and you, you don't know the basic product that you need then this video is for you in today's video i'll be talking about the essentials or the important products or revamping kits that you need to have at home you know especially for beginners and maybe you want to can still take this even as a professional like you want to, you can see this video can still be helpful to you as a professional at least for something you need something that you need to start with you know product you need to have at home you know to make your revamping to make your hair washing or hair laundry easy for you because one thing i know is that once you have the right product i always say this forget it you you can no matter what although maybe it's when it comes to styling that is when you might have little issue but when it comes to washing once you have the right product, it, at least it will go a long way. So these are the things I want to talk about in today's uh, video. First, revamping product or kits or revamping product that you need in your revamping kit or you need to have if you want to do your uh, revamping that is beginner for beginners is shampoo. Yes, shampoo is very, very important to start with. In fact, that is one of the, that's the number one thing that you must have. If you want to revamp because you know that's when you start with you are washing your wig you need a shampoo to take off those deaths so you need shampoo and i always advise people to avoid shampoos that are you know very harsh i've talked about different shampoos so i don't want because i don't want this video to be too long so i will leave link of those shampoos and the products the different type of product that you can use for you know for your revamping so this video will not be too long so shampoos is very very important especially not harsh shampoos sulfate free shampoos cream based shampoos you know shampoos that are not that doesn't have alcohol or little alcohol or don't they don't have alcohol so those are the kind of shampoo that you need so that to start with in your revamping ki kits rather shampoo is an essential product you need so the next on my list is a uh, conditioners yes conditioners deep conditioners deep conditioning marks whatever but anything that has to come with a uh, conditioners which we have different type of conditioners which i just mentioned this also is very very important you know that you must have as a beginner when it comes to revamping that you know you need it in your revamping kit because <laughs> Conditioner, in fact, I don't joke with it because it, it that's the main cocoa. <laughs> that is what we determine if that particular wig or air will come back to life. Because conditioner do a lot of you know do a very play a major role when it comes to revamping, play an important role when it comes to revamping. So you need conditioner, and I've talked about different type of air. Conditioner, different type of deep conditioner, different type of deep conditioning mask, which I don't need to start mentioning them. So, if you are still confused on the particular one to get, check through my channel. I have different videos on uh, deep conditioner or conditioner say, for revamping as well. But this also is another very, very must have. In fact, there's no two way about it. There's not. I don't. I, I don't even need to pet you or tell you. Okay, it's optional. No, this is important. This is a must have essential for revamping the next important product essential that you need as a beginner in your revamping kit or for your revamping or hair laundry is leave-in conditioners and serums yes this is uh, an uh, after styling or after washing uh, a product yes because you know after you wash uh, do all the washing and deep conditioning you need product for your styling as well because it will determine how this air will turn out so you must have these two products serum and the deep conditioner serums uh, is for straight air while the leave-in conditioner is for coily 
hairs as well then mousse also is very very important in fact mousse is a must have as well when it comes to products for in fact i don't joke with mousse especially when it comes to coily hair and also when it comes to a uh, product uh, for you know maybe for your closure or frontal you need mousse as well these three products is a must have and there are some products that are not expensive i've talked about different living conditioner different serums also in this channel which i don't want to go into that not to make this video to be too long so just check through my channel if you are also confused on the type of serum to buy or living conditioner to buy mousse to buy i have orishi orishi different type of video but you need these three products as well to be in your revamping essential kits so the next on my list is a wastig yes wastig mm, although i think this is more of for a professional but it's also really good because one thing with wastig is that if you have if you must have wastig you need to have a hot comb yes so is also important as well then that's why i also talked about mousse as well so even if you don't have wastic mousse is very very important because it will make the job easy for you mousse does you know make the job faster that's for if you don't have certain type of uh, products that's a styling product tools yes for for your revamping kit so wastic also is also very important i'm talking wastic especially for those that are doing it for uh, professionally like they are doing it as a business so you need wastic them also if you also uh, for your personal use wastic also is a uh, very very important as well but essential the uh, things that you need for revamping you know as a beginner also is a uh, styling tools yes the styling tools is made up of a uh, straightener yes straightener is really really important especially for your straight air for your bobs especially you know because these are something that you need to do from time to time you need to because especially for bob taking your bob wig to a stylist all the time to to style for you is not something i would advise so straightener is really really important in fact if you don't have other tools you see straightener straightener is a must have you need a hot comb as well well hot comb is also important but i feel is more of like for a professional but if you want to take your styling game to another level i think i will also suggest a hot combs having hot combs is not bad if you can afford it it's also very important as well like you know now you want your 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 styling your revamping your wigs to come out you know on point like those ones i used to see on instagram <laughs> you need hot comb and also coiler as well like electric coiler is also very important especially when you want to spice up your look maybe you have that long straight hair and you want to spice it up to make it coily or you have bouncy coil uh, coiler also is very important as well as one of the tools that you also need for your revamping uh, kits next on my list is a uh, rollers yes you know, we have different type of rollers we have bendy rollers we have a uh, plastic rollers which i'll leave pictures for you to see at least if you cannot afford to get the electric rollers especially for those that have bouncy coil i think you should check you should have a uh, this uh, any of these uh, rollers is also very very important you know for your heatless uh, metal kind of uh, uh, rolling your bouncy coil even your straight and uh, maybe you want to change it and you don't have coiler you cannot avoid coil, uh, coiling iron for now you can also use a uh, rollers to do that you know to give you that a uh, very nice and the bouncy the coils also is also very very nice and uh, beautiful as well which you can you know use it and that's why you also need mousse as well for you know to do the styling so at least if you don't want to take it to a professional you can do this as well yourself just check out any videos on youtube on how to do it and you'll be able to do it so guys i almost forgot this particular one and it's also very very important so you need a mannequin head because without this mannequin head if you want to especially when you want to straighten your wig or you want to uh, coil your wig in fact for the styling part you need a mannequin head so this is a must-have as well and it's not expensive at least 
so it's something that is less than if the uh, thousand five thousand naira and i would advise that if you want to buy a mannequin uh, and make sure you buy the one that has a clamp so that you'll be able to attach it to anything and uh, fix the mannequin there that's for those if you are not a professional for personal use you don't need we stand so this you just make sure you buy this clamp that's the thing that is beside the mannequin head that is showing on the screen is a clamp so buy it together with the mannequin head so you can just fix it anywhere and style your hair your wig anytime you want to after uh, washing it for the proper as in for the overall revamping so another important uh, things that you need that should be as part of your revamping kit is also combs and brushes these are very very important as well because you need it for brushing for smoothing you need it for detangling as well and you don't use a uh, everything as you don't use one particular comb or brush for all texture no there are combs that are good for coily and there are brushes and combs that are good for straight as well so and bouncy as well so for brushes you need a brazilian brush for straight air white tooth comb as well for straight air then also the uh, the octopus uh, detangling or uh, octopus brush too you need it for uh, for your coily hair as well after you know uh, for the styling so you need it to comb to uh, when you apply your leave-in conditioner or mousse you need it to you know to make your coils pop more then also detangling uh, combs also is very good especially for coily hair you need it to detangle the coils first even before you wash uh, you start washing the coily uh, wig or even after washing the coil even during the washing process like maybe you apply leave-in conditioner you want to still detangle the coils you still need detangling uh, brush as a uh, comb as well and you also need the uh, detangling brush for after styling as well so combs and brushes are very very important you don't just have one particular type of comb like just check out the pictures of the comb that i displayed in this video these are the kind of combs and brushes that you need that you should have in your revamping so kits that's it for this video although i know there are others too but for this particular one especially for beginners that you don't need any of those um you know complicated things so these are at least some of the basic things that at least if you really want to do some your personal repair or wig revamping these are some of the products that at least essential products that i think you should have at least if you have all these products you are good to go your revamping game will be top notch and it will come out nice and uh, so that's it for this video is there anyone that i did not mention that you feel is important share in the comment section so others can learn like i always say i don't know it all in this channel your contributions are always welcome and if there's any question you like to ask relating to revamping relating to this video feel free to ask me in the comment section i'll be glad to answer you to the best of my knowledge thank you for watching see you in my next video bye for now